Uh, Luke, congratulations. They made it tough for you, didn't they? Yeah, um, I think they always do, I think, especially when we come here. Um, we know it's going to be a very hard game. Um, they're under a new manager, first Premier League game at home. Of course, they're, they're going to make it tough for us. But I think we made it even harder for ourselves in the first half. Nowhere near, nowhere near at it. Um, I think the manager made that extremely clear at half-time. Um, but maybe still not the best in the second half. But I think in games like this, we have to find a way to win. Um, and we, we didn't used to do that. Um, but of course, like I said, it, it always helps when you've got someone like Marcus Rashford to, to come off the bench and, and make a difference. And he, he did that. Eric, congratulations. That was a hard-fought win. You said it was going to be a tough one before the game, didn't you? Yeah, that's what you could expect. Yeah. New manager, first home game. Uh, it's good, good players, they have good team. Uh, so you have to be front foot, but we were not. Uh, first half, uh, half hour, uh, first half. I wasn't happy with the performance. I think second half was better. Uh, we should have scored before half-time, clear. But it's also a part of be ready, uh, be bright uh, and be decisive. Um, it's, a, it's a nice feeling for a, a forward to, to have that um, happening for them. So, um, you know, mentioned in some of the other interviews, it's, it's a difficult place to come for us to, to play our football and to win games. And we didn't necessarily play our best football, but, but we got three points. And I think for a team that's developing and, you know, striving to be the best that we can be, you have to be able to win games like that in that fashion. And I'm, I'm, I'm actually really pleased that we, that we managed to do it today. He has got... Um a sense of purpose around him at the moment, the bit between his teeth, however you want to describe it, he feels like a Marcus Rashford who's back to his best. Um, yeah, I think he's in an extremely good place. Um, I think for us and everyone, the quality's always been there. Um, for me, he can be one of the best in the world. Um, but for now, it's about keeping them standards high. You know, the, the consistency is, is key to, to being a top, top player, one of the best in the world. And I think he's certainly in that in that place in that way at the moment. With with his delivering every game, he's making a difference. And you know, for me, I think hopefully he can keep that up um, because, like I said, he can be the best in the world if if, if he carries on. Um, what what went wrong in that first 45 minutes? Why weren't you happy with the performance? We had a problem defending organisation, but especially yeah, just decisive and. Um, uh, winning your battles, winning your duels, and uh, also in offense, uh, they, uh, uh, in the offense duels we were easy. Uh, we are run off the ball, uh, so you have to keep the balls and let them run. And looking at across the board, everybody seems to be enjoying the football. I spoke to, to Luke before, and he's just got a grin plastered over his face. He's played two games at centre half, and he's loved every second of it. it. It feels like there's just a really good feeling about about life at the minute. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, we've got players that are capable and, and willing to, you know, like Luke, to play out of position and put themselves in, in a situation where they might not be 100% comfortable, but can they deal with it 100% and, you know, sure he's done it back to back games now. Um, I'm not sure he's enjoying it as much as he, he's, he's saying he is, but um, yeah, it's, it's definitely a big plus for us to have players that are, you know, capable to play in different positions because over the course of a season we're going we're gonna to need it. Now up until the Nottingham Forest game you'd never played uh, as a central defender on the left hand side of a two. Um, new position for you because you, you're like a Rolls Royce Lou. <laughs> nah, I don't know, we've got, we've got a lot of world class centre backs so you know, I don't think so but I'm not going to lie, I've been really enjoying it. Um, it's obviously something very different, something I've not, not experienced before. I, I've obviously played centre back but in a three. Um, and, it, and it is totally different but you know like I said I think the manager needed me to play there and you know for the team I'm happy to play wherever um, as long as I'm on that pitch um, but like I said I'm really enjoying it um, I think it it always helps when you've got someone you know with the world-class ability that, that they have next to me and of course the ones that, that, that are not playing with Vic and Harry they've been extremely helpful too with you know giving me details on, on what to do and you know they've all helped really much. What was your favourite bit about your goal? Was it the initial touch? Was it the strength to hold off Johnny? Was it the finish? Which bit of it do you think you um, enjoyed the most? The, the finish is always the best bit. You know, when the ball hits the the back of the net, it's a it's a great feeling. Um, but yeah, I just thought that the overall, you know, build up to the goal was was good. We 
they were a difficult team to break down. I think at that moment they were five at the back as well, so you know not not that much space to, to play with. But you know we managed to find the gaps and, and make it count. Does Rafa coach you through the game? Does he talk to you as, as you go through, or is, does he leave you to your own devices? No, it's it's a mixture really. I think you always got to be communicating, especially when when you're together in a in a back four. Um, we speak a lot during the game, both of us. Um, but no, nah, it's normal. I think we all, you know, as a defender, you've got to talk across the back line because you know there's always different movements. But you know, like I said, uh, I'm really enjoying it. But the most important thing is, is obviously the three points. Nice to see a smile on your face. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.